Nice kill. Thank you. Open no verse clear. Alright, uh, Trappy. They're party coming from from dark room. No one's reviving him, so I'm gonna snag him. I'm gonna snag him. Hey, I'm dying, man. I am dying. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Why <laughs> wouldn't anyone watching what show? Oh, fuck. It came through there. Yeah, really? on, on my body. You from behind, that was messed up. What? What was that? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna watch, I guess, Dark Room and, um, my Shulk, I'm guessing. Here, push straight to up and over. We could. Up and over. They're probably gonna be up, up and over now, though. Oh my god. Psst. Hey, back up. Fuck! Every goddamn time I press T, uh, V instead of, uh, I mean, fuck, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're good to go! I pressed T instead of fucking uh, G, uh, G to bandage up. And fucking you mean so L? Low. Yeah, I, I pressed something. <laughs> Dude, I just mu like button mush my fucking. <laughs> I'm not even knowing what I'm clicking here. T, 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 G, 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 G. Alright. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice it says it up in the top. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the T is not fair now. It's okay, I got you this. You need some more people to join. I got this, I can do it. Clutch! Clutch! I got this. I got this. I got this. <laughs> you might be right ahead of me. I'm always right. And they're going to right group. Uh, right below me, but I can do this. I got this. It's all in the skill. It's all in the skill. Probably up and over. He's up, he's upstairs, he's upstairs. Alright, Trappy, I'm gonna run out and see if I can snipe just go, him. Yeah, just go, 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 no, he's upstairs, he's upstairs, yeah. I'll just run for it, because he's, he's coming down the stairs now. Run, run, run! Run for us! Ooh, decent, decent, I know you mean that. You can hear him walking. Not sure if he left the stairs or not. Oh, I'm gonna switch my, uh, I don't know if I can. I switch my volume on my computer. Give me one second. I'm gonna switch it to my, uh, surround. There we go. Way better. Way better. I Should I wish it and run it? Final 
one minute, what you gonna do? <laughs> Final loot, what you gonna do? Go <laughs> boo! Yeah! Oh, what? Yeah! <laughs> I should have saw that coming. I win. <laughs> I should have saw that coming. Yeah, you should have. Oh, fun. You, you like Markman's Marksman so much? Sniper? <laughs> you know, maybe I'll choose Sniper. <laughs> you know what? Okay, I got this. I was Plus. in camping back in, um... And I'm guarding and just hiding back there with the marshman. Yeah, I saw you. I gotta not ever hit any of my shots, but. <laughs> well, that's good to know. You know that pinch hits? Not in garden? Up, up and over. Yeah, he's upstairs. Oh, what? Never Come mind, on, I'm trying to you. give you a hug. I just was going to I should have. 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 I or Paladins, actually. You know what? I'm gonna play a game of Paladins. I haven't played Paladins for a while there. So. Jesus Christ. Let's play some Paladins. I haven't played this in a long time. Fuck. See if I can get this going. It's not showing up on the OBS. Um, oh, give me one minute. I'll get it going. Oh, 
not responding. So I'm clicking too much shit. Like, whoa, dude, chill out. Chill out. Stop clicking shit. Maybe we'll fucking load. Okay, so loaded. Good, we're good. We're in. Oh, you little shit. See, I'm not used to this. Your champion. That one is Vector. Vector. Seconds remaining. What are you going to do then? Fifteen seconds remaining. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let the battle begin. The battle is about to begin.
Oh, I was smart. Enemy killing spree. Probably really annoying for you guys. Flying probably way too high. <sighs> I did so bad.
walk. Select a champion. Vamos. Lex. Vamos. Genos, 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 Genos. Customize your champion. Seconds remaining. I bring destruction. Fifteen to seconds you. remaining. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. The battle has begun. Have fun. Prepare for battle. Heal with that and then kill with this. What, you wanna fuck with me, bud? Take it off. Don't worry, I got you. Fuck him. Fuck him, destroy this. Killing spree. Kill them. Oh, my God. 
Let's go. Such a hard fucking one to land though, because it takes Enemy so long. Triple kill. Slate, slate, slate. It's all the fucking girl bags. I didn't mind him actually, but it's the part because it's all the smart <laughs> smoke there so I'm just gonna close the game for a second so that noise isn't playing in the background jump you over to here 
Uh, you know what? Let's watch some uh, Amazing World of Gumball. Is it drawer in the fridge? Mmm. <gasps> I thought we agreed no secrets. <clears throat> oh, who am I kidding? I still love you. Dinner is served. I'm impressed. You're really taking this diet thing seriously. Sure I am. My book says if you use tiny plates, you eat less. Um, that only works if you have one tiny plate. What diet is this? Well, that's the no-carb diet. That's the high-protein diet. That's the 5-2 diet. That's the 2-5 diet. That's the... Pizza delivery! And that... My reward for dieting. Hey, Mr. Dad, I like your new roll neck sweater. I'm not wearing a roll neck. Oh, it's your, uh, actual neck roll. Are you sure this diet's working? Absolutely. I feel incredible. It's given me so much energy. Yeah, you did just sleep for 36 hours. <gasps> that means I missed a whole day's eating. Hmm, it's weird. Since I started dieting, we run out of food so quickly I have to go buy groceries every day. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Hmm. That's it. I should get the groceries delivered. <sighs> Done. Let's go to the grocery store. But you just ordered a whole load of food. I've got to have something to eat in the meantime, don't I? Chewing is one of the best ways to burn calories. It's taking him forever. this diet's working. Okay, Darwin and I are going to help you diet properly. What do you know about dieting? The internet exists. We don't need to know anything. We will be your thin spiration. Your slim presarios. You... Okay, I think he gets it. Hmm. Now, if you want to take this seriously, you need to be open and honest about what you eat. Do you have any food in the house we don't know about? Uh... Dad! <sighs> I thought that would throw you guys off. Hmm. so bad? Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's it. We're putting you in lockdown. Somewhere where there's no food. Fishfinger, do you copy? I repeat. Fishfinger, do you copy? All quiet here. I repeat. All quiet here, Night Towel. Uh, it's Night Owl. Wait, I'm picking up some interference here. Sounds like chewing. What's he doing in there? I can't make it out. Do you see anything? <laughs> he has a burger. Repeat. He has a burger. You're gonna have to go in. And Darwin, be careful. He's dead. <gasps> He's gone. That's, that's impossible. What can you see? Oh my gosh. The hamburger's fake. <gasps> it must be a trap. Get out of there. Abort. Abort. <gasps> Saliva. Fridge! Oh, this is a new low. Man, feels like a very familiar low. Dad moves so fast when there's food involved. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? We use food to trick Dad into exercising. Huh, that never usually works. You probably shouldn't have said your plan out loud right in front of me. Don't worry, his short-term memory is terrible. So, what are we talking about? There it is. <laughs> Ooh. It's working! 
Nothing! But it feels like something's missing. Training wheels? Nah, where's you all for the... Synth rock and crossfades? to get that fit was a montage. Yeah, and quick too. It was under a minute. Ah, that tune is so annoying. I still got it going around in my head. Me too. Oh, he's still montaging. I'm sure he'll tire himself out soon. Hey, get off of my car! Get out of the way, Watterson! Get out of the way of my car! That's right, buddy. Honk if you think I'm tongue. Oh, look. We've created a monster. Yeah, a really ripped one. Say, which one of you two fine specimens is coming with me to the ball? People there are going to want to see me with my shirt off. Yeah, uh, I, I think we're going to stay home. I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to these babies. Oh, for Christ what? We have to follow him. Because he's a danger to himself? No, because there's a danger he'll embarrass us. Thanks for the lift. I was trying to run you over. How are we going to know where he is? Don't worry. He's selfieing now. He updates his profile picture every five seconds. We can work it out from that. See? Look at those puppies. I don't want to see that. Oh, not what I expected. <gasps> that means he's at the pet store. Oh, now he's at the nursery. What's he doing now? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm really sorry to bother you, but... <laughs> it's quite all right. I get this all the time. I'm ready for you to take my picture. Um... Don't worry. I've got this. Uh, actually, um... Wait, I'll just tag it. Chilling with my fans. Yeah, I just wanted to see if you were using this chair. You mean this chair? You know what? Don't worry about it. You can take this table if you like. Yeah, uh, never mind. <laughs> Where is he? <gasps> He's in Paris? London? New Jersey? Oh, he's at the travel agents. By the fountain. Come on! I wish for a world in which everyone can live together in peace and harmony. <gasps> Don't worry, kid. I'll rescue that corn. How is he doing that? And why? Be more careful next time, big guy. Uh, thanks? I guess that means no world peace. <laughs> Where did he go? <gasps> the parking lot! Hey, buddy, where are you going with my tires? <gasps> hey, stop! That guy has to be stopped! I mean, his abs are phenomenal, but he has got to be stopped! We have a fire on West Elmore Boulevard. Wait, there's a guy. He's taking the hose, sir. He's he's posing with the hose, sir. Sir. Uh, uh, maybe it's not him? Look at the size of those biceps. Yeah, it's definitely him. Sir, for pity's sake, I need the hose to put on the fire. There might be people in there. He stole my helmet. <laughs> you join us here as our brave fire department are prevented from doing their job by a local jerk. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's just making his abs more defined. Magnificent! Everything we try just makes him more beautiful. It feels so safe in those arms. Ah, stop! You're taking this too far! You've become vain! Remember what's important to you! What means more to you than anything else? Yes! Remember your family! No food! Remember food!
You join us here as a local hero has put out a house fire without the aid of our useless fire department. Who needs firemen anyway? I'm sorry, kids. I guess I went a bit too far. Let me make it up to you. Who wants pizza? And after that, we can go for Mexican. And after that, we can go for Chinese. Oh, and we should get a burrito, too. And maybe some ice cream. You know what? I could also really go for a taco right now. There's this place I know where they toast the tacos first. Then, maybe a burger. We think 14-year-old Jojo Siwa is an artist you should know. I'ma come back like a boomerang. A lot more music coming out. With her trademark hair bows, Jojo's anti-bullying anthem boomerang has racked up more than 300 million views on YouTube. Once I hit 100, I was like, it's kind of weird. Like, why is it doing so good? People love it because of the message. Now she's been named Nick Cannon's sidekick on the Nickelodeon series Lip Sync Battle Shorties. JoJo has a new book, a doll, and she's getting her own Nickelodeon special, My World. So basically, it's all leading up to my um, performance that I did at Mall of America. So it's like the rehearsals for that, the preparation for that. And she set her sights high. I want to be like Britney Spears. I want to do the whole music thing, and I want to do the whole Vegas thing. That is my goal in life. <laughs> Well, the Tour de France can't be won between Arras and Roubaix, but it could well be lost. Of the 156.5 kilometres to cover, a whopping 21.7 will be over the 15 cobbled sectors. There are five winners of Paris-Roubaix in the peloton. Nicky Terpstra, John Zagenkob, Matthew Heyman, Greg Van Avermaet and Peter Sagan. But they won't be the only ones gunning for glory. Well, the riders had been gearing up for this mini Hell of the North long before the Tour started, and it was a frantic start to the stage. It was a major GC casualty shortly after a group of 10 riders that got away at the front. Disaster for BMC leader Richie Port, forced to abandon after crashing heavily. He was later taken to hospital where they suspected broken collarbone. Bitter disappointment for the Australian, who also quit the Tour on stage nine last year. The breakaway getting to the first of 15 cobbled sectors and some strong riders in there as well. Thomas de Ghent, Omar Frail and Chad Hager. A couple of early issues for the AG2R leader, Roman Bardet. Frenchman had to change his bike not once but twice after a series of mechanicals. That's where Dylan Grunewagen, the winner of stages seven and eight, went to ground, as did Sky's Egan Bernal. A big spill causing a split in the peloton. Sky choosing to put the hammer down at the front and pulling away with Van Avermaet and Sagan. Vincenzo Nibali, Rigoberto Urana and Adam Yates left behind in the second group. Terpstra, the 2014 Paris-Roubaix winner, was the next man to hit the deck. He finished over 16 minutes down. A couple of SKPs struggling to keep up here, Nicola Ede and Jérôme Cousin. 
with 50 kilometers to go. The gap to the breakaway was down to around 90 seconds. And the Mayo Jean himself attacking after the seventh cobbled sector. His teammate TJ Van Garder and losing time after a crash. Bardo with yet another puncture. The last men standing in the break, Damian Gouda and Reinhard Janse van Rensburg are caught with 33k to go. Movistar and Education first, also limiting their time losses for Mikkel Lander and Rigoberto Uran. The decisive move came in the penultimate cobbled section. Belgian road race champion Yves Lompert attacking, taking Van Avermaet and Dagen Kolp with him, two former Paris-Roubaix winners. Chasing pack not reacting quickly enough, and the leading trio soon had a 30-second advantage. Yet another puncture for Bardo, meanwhile. But he only lost a handful of seconds. A game of cat and mouse in the final kilometre, but Dagen Kolp has simply had too much power for the others. After finishing second on six occasions, he finally has a stage win at the Tour. Pure delight for Dagen Kolp then, but this night's stage was an emotional roller coaster for BMC. The Americans kept hold of the yellow jersey after another fine performance from Van Avermaet. That's now seven days in a row for the Olympic champion. But on the other, they lost their leader. And they'll now have to gear up for the mountain stages without Richie Port, who was understandably distraught to have to quit on stage nine yet again. <laughs> Pure happiness. Really, I'm, uh, I, was, I was chasing this victory so long. And... Uh, uh, it's, it's really hard to describe. Everybody said, uh, I'm done. I'm, after this accident, I will never come back. And uh, it's, uh, I said, no, I'm not done. I have to bring at least one big, one really big victory. Well, Taken Kolb now has at least one stage win at all three Grand Tours after coming in ahead of Van Avermaet and Lampert. Philippe Gilbert, Pippin, Peter Sagan to fourth place, but the Slovak remains in green. Van Avermaet has 43 seconds over Sky's Garant Thomas overall. Gilbert up to third. Alejandro Valverde goes fifth, a minute and 31 seconds off the pace. After a well-deserved rest day in Annecy on Monday, the tour resumes with the first real mountain stage on Tuesday. The climbers will tackle the all category Plateau de Glière, six kilometers at over 11%, as well as three category one cols, the Coiffry, Rom and the Colombière, before a downhill run into Le Grand Bonnard. It won't be one for the faint of heart. Thanks for watching, enjoy the rest day and do join us again on Tuesday. miserable so maybe we should put Kalani in her place. No I never said yes, that. Yes you most certainly no, did. No I didn't think that. Listen I said Brooke is your mother Get speaking your for finger you? Do you out want to of be my your... face. Girls out the room. Yeah, you out, the room. Oh, out, out the room. Out of the room. Out the Get away from out me. Out the room. Girls out of the room. Who do you think right you are? Now. Girls out of the room. Nuts. All of you no, out you're of the room. Now out of the room. I am so sick of that. Kalani let's go. Go. She's a bitch and I'm done. Oh. Yeah, you are. I'm done. Do not treat my child like that. You begged me to get your kid back. Do not. I want this kid with me. I don't want her with you. Sleeping with some guy you're not even married to. No. And look what you do. Look what you do. When she steps out on the stage with those kids, with my kids, all eyes are going to be on her because she's the new kid on the block and nobody knows who she is. She deserves a shot. A chance. You've had her for two days. That's it. Are you That's crying? It. Are you crying? I, I'm upset. You're insulting my daughter. I'm insulting you. It's embarrassing. Shut your mouth. Shut I, your woo! mouth. That was good. No, 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 I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. No, I really, I thought the witch would melt. So no, I'm just I really, did. I apologize. I didn't okay. know the lid was off. You know what? Because I didn't mean to do that either. I asked for choreography that was what my kids can do. Well, I wanted you know what? them to be challenged. Right. Not I am the I best thing for pay. But yeah, guess what? My daughter was a wreck all freaking week. She's sick
contente de vous voir. Grouillons-nous un peu les fesses. Je suis enceinte. Mais il faut le dire à personne pour le bébé, d'accord J'en ai parlé à Bill. Je l'ai dit à beaucoup, beaucoup de personnes. Mamma mia. There. What are you doing out there? Uh, I was, yeah. Because in my mind, uh, soccer's played with a ball, uh, right? I wasn't trying. I was trying to run towards the goal. You're not getting points by running through the goal post. The ball has to go through. Brendan, I'm going to show you something, all right? Mm -hmm. Maybe this will give you a little incentive. All right. Look at my arm right there. See that? Yeah. I got that when I was 18 years old. Uh, I'll tell you something. Yeah. I regret it. Because this tattoo don't come off. Right. I have a tattoo of a cow's head because I love that cheese then. So I get the cow, I go in there, I'm a little drunk. And I say, give me that cow head from that cheese. I love that cheese. Uh -huh. Now I have a cow, a cheese cow on my arm, Brendan. Don't get a tattoo. That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> okay. Play soccer. Brendan, take a look at my chest. I gotta go, Mr. McGurk. No, I'm serious. Look at that. No, that's nice, Mr. You know I really what that is right there? Back on that's the, the woman from the Chiquita <laughs> Banana. I got that tattooed on my chest. I am an idiot. I got trademark products all over my body. It's like going to a market because I was drunk one night. Wow. Don't live like me. Right. All right? Now you go out there and play great. You know what? I'm going to crack the egg. I'm going to crack the egg because if you do it, you're going to drip it all down the side of the bowl. I know, I know not on purpose. Honey, mommy can't deal with spills. No, uh, I mom, just... mom, guess what? I got my. I finished the preview for my movie. I'd really like to. to, to put, would you please look at it, please? Yeah. Please, mom. Please, yes, please, yes. Please. Go ahead, show me. Okay, here it goes. It's a. Uh, What's it called? Uh, it's called the, the Dark Side of the Law. In a world, turns out your old partner has gone dirty, gone mad. He's gone dirty. He's a dirty cop. There stands one. People don't understand me. I wanted to make a difference. Cop. Jason, we, we went to the academy together. Fighting. You were a good cop. Don't try to sweet talk me against evil. 
I set up the bomb then with 3,000 wires. And and if you cut the wrong wire, the bomb explodes. Injustice. Pink, Melissa. Blue or red? All right, here we go. Clip. Dark side of the law. What do you think? That's, huh? You know, is it too early to start writing the speech? Well, uh, I, you know, I'd like to thank my mother. Yeah, no, don't worry. You're in there somewhere. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's my mother in the back row with the damp cloth. Hey, uh, Bryn, can I tell you something? Uh, mm-hmm. It's kind of weird. I mean, it's it, that's not that big a deal. A, I, I want to let you know that I'm I'm going to go out tonight. Mm, where are you going? I'm going to go on a date. You going on? Yep. Um, I don't remember that uh, you're supposed to do that. I thought that you, what you do is not do that. Women are supposed to go on dates, especially newly divorced women. They're supposed to spring uh, forth well, and uh, and think about me. life and youth. I am absolutely supposed to go on a date. I've been hiding my light under your under your dad's bushel. Uh, Mom, that's making me. I'm a little. Wait, wait. There's one more thing. I want to tell you who I'm going out with. <laughs> I'm going out with uh, Mr. McGurk. Come again, Mr. McGurk. My soccer coach. Yes, Brendan. Yes. We. Um, oh, wait, wait. What? What? Your mom's going on a date with. Yes, McGurk. McGurk the jerk. I don't understand. It's. Let me tell you about women a little bit, Melissa. Hey guys. Hi, Dad. Hi, Eric. Nice sandbox, pal. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, it's a. Uh, aren't you too too old to be playing in a sandbox? I'm not playing though. I'm I'm sitting in a sandbox. This is where I come mm-hmm. to reflect on things. And you're looking for. Uh... I'm looking for answers to questions. Mm-hmm. I'm looking for t- solutions to problems. I I am. I came out here and I've been digging up things and I found this. Ew. Oh, gross. And I don't know. Yeah, who's... I think you should bury that again. What's going on, Brendan? I'm kind of in a bad mood. Missy, we gotta get going. Tell my dad. Maybe he could help. You know how you pick us up and Coach McGurk's there? That mm-hmm. Big, fat, crappy Irish guy. Well, I don't think that's... The, yeah. I mean, that's not the problem. Right. The problem that is that he's dating my mom tonight. He's going out on a date. Mm-hmm. That, that's... See, you have so much going on. So many things to be, to be happy about. No. You know, Melissa tells me about your ideas for movies. Has, mm-hmm. I've seen some of your early work, and it's wonderful. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh, what was your favorite one? Don't put me on the spot, please. I'm sorry. I, 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 you know, I just I, I appreciate <clears throat> the gesture. Well, Melissa, we have to be at, at Mr. Buck's studio in 10 minutes. In 10 minutes? Yeah. We have what, made a commitment. What, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> We're going to play at this recital in three weeks, Melissa and I, and we've been practicing this. Sonata. It's a Mozart piano and violin sonata. I, I didn't even know you played violin, Eric. I oh, told you about yeah, the play, I, recital. I'm constantly learning things about you. Well, this is only the first thing. Yeah, I mean, this is the first thing I've ever we're, learned. We're but playing I mean, a, a sonata in E minor. Maybe Brendan doesn't Mozart. have time right no, now. No, no, I'm going to hear this. He's got a lot is, on his mind. No, Dad, like put it away. Oh. That's, that's I like that. Yeah. I I feel strangely like cheered up by your playing. <laughs> it's a new awkward feeling that I'm gonna have to deal with. I think I'm, I'm like a minstrel, I guess. I almost, you know what? No, no, I don't. I like to go into this date with almost a chip on my shoulder. Uh-huh. How dare he ask me out? <laughs> How dare anybody put me through this? What are you I'm wearing just. This is my feeling. Right now, I'm at the precipice of my life. I'm, 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 I'm at a turning point. I've decided that I'm just going to go dressed how I am dressed, because otherwise, it's almost false advertising. I'm wearing a, a big baggy pants and a shirt that makes a man want to buy me another shirt. Yeah, yeah. I think I have just the right attitude, don't you? Is that what you're wearing tonight? Yeah, this is a seersucker jacket. It's very nice. Yeah, but it's, do you think it's in season? Don't be a wise guy, all right? <laughs> Want to be a dumb guy, huh? No, what, are you, what are you talking about, Brendan? I don't know. You don't mess with me, all right? Yeah, I'll mess with you. you. You like? Can I get you something? What, what do you, you drink? No, I'm fine. You have you like a whiskey? No, I had a couple of whiskeys before I got here. You smell like it. You smell like it. Listen a... to me, Brendan. I want this date with your mom and I to go well, all right? Right. Don't mess it up. You know what? Can I give you a piece of advice? Don't take the jacket off because you're starting to sweat through it. And then they see the shirt underneath it. You're just going to look like sweat man. Yeah, Unless you get the whole thing wet. There's nothing wrong with sweating if you're a man. That's what happens. Oh, my God. Have you met my sister? No, I haven't. She's very cute. I'd like to say hi to her. Hello. Yeah, you know what? You're kind of a lucky guy. What you come that? in here, you got a, you got a family already, 
right? This is, whose kid is this? I don't know, yours now, <laughs> right? No, that's, not, that's not the way it's going to yeah, be. Yeah, it's the way it's going to be, isn't it? Yeah. You know, Brendan, I know what you're doing. You know how to hold a child? Well, Have you ever held a baby and had it look at you like it really loves you and you know, needs you? Brendan, I'll tell you something right ever now, all right? I know what you're trying to do. Yeah. Oh, yeah? I know what you're trying to do, uh -huh. and that's not going to work. Can you, seriously, can you carry me for a second? I'm not going to carry you. Get right. your hands off me, Brendan. Please, come on, Dad. I better go. No, come on, let's play catch. Tell your mom I don't feel Seriously, it. I think I love you. I swear to God, I'm going to come down harder on you on Monday. It's going to be like a friggin' hurricane. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm going to take you. Oh, hello, hey, Paul. Hello, well, I was just talking to Brendan and having a nice yeah, conversation. We had a really good talk. <laughs> Are you ready to go? Of course, that's not it. I mean, that's not the only thing that goes into coaching, having big legs. <laughs> I think I just ate a whole clove of garlic. Oof. Well, well, look, you know what it, you know what it is? I mean, I think mm -hmm. I, I don't want to get into a whole conversation about uh, anything. Yeah. But um, <laughs> I come from a family that, that was split up. Yeah. Uh, it can be hard on a kid. I, I remember having the same feelings, you know? Yeah. It's why I dropped out of school, which I expect Brendan might do someday. I mean, I, I, you, know, you never know what's going to happen when, uh, when a family falls apart. It's a prison. Right. And, and then... I'm coming to visit you in the prison because I'm your yeah, mother. Yeah, you feel horrible for what I've done. I've done something terrible. How come we're in France? Because that's where dramatic things take place. Okay. Right, okay, here goes. Guard! Guard! Yes. Hello, guard. Hello. I could use some water and some bread, for I haven't had any in weeks. There's someone here to see you. Mother. Son, you look so thin. Yes, I lost a lot of weight here at the prison. Um... French. Yes, here in France. It's all my fault. It should be me behind bars with a French stupid guard, not you. Yes, I agree, Mother. You're a horrible person. Mrs. Small, look at my hat. Okay, and... Well, his nose is all whoa, running. Whoa, 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 Okay, cut, Ew. cut. I'm oh, sorry. What happened, Jason? <laughs> can you... It's like a oh gallon. God. I can make it go down, suck it all the way back in. Oh. <laughs> People Brendan. hate me. <laughs> oh, you know, I mean, the mm -hmm. the kids don't want to do anything. You know, that's that's uh, in my experience, Paula. Yeah. Kids are always like, I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I consider it my job to kind of twist them in the uh, direction of doing stuff. Yeah. I mean, that's what coaching's all about. That's why I love it. I mean, every day I go out there and I twist the kids into doing uh, something they don't want to do. Yeah. Excuse me, waiter. Can I get another one of these as soon as possible? I'm not supposed to mix it with medication, but I'm going to make a rare exception to the rule. All right, everybody gather around. Mm -hmm. I uh, took the weekend to think about uh, everything we did wrong on Friday. And I'll tell you something. I watched some professional soccer on television Sunday afternoon. I'll tell you there's a major gap between what I saw on television and where we are right now. First of all, you're all eight. Hey, what's these it? people were in their twenties. Hey, no, no, they were a lot like, older, this, but they were a lot this. better. Look at this right here. What's this? What? Brendan, Melissa, well, what yes, are you doing? Nothing. Listen up, right? Yeah. What do you think we're doing? We're talking. Hey, Brendan, you watch your mouth. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, Did Brendan. Yeah. I'm addressing the team.
my genius will be understood eventually. I did not change my rooms. <laughs> The Summoner's Rift. Everybody deserves a second shot. Thirty seconds until minions spawn. 
Less trouble killing you again. The Minions have spawned. And I have enough mercy to go around.
secured.
down. An enemy has been slain.
right now. Peace out guys. Playing for two hours. I'll stream again in a little bit. Have a good night.